What are you eating? I just made some gingerbread men. Can I have one? Well, that's why I made them. Merry Christmas. Wait, you're saying that's my present? No, I just thought it would be fun. Where are they? I just put them on the living room table. Help yourself. I think I will. Headless gingerbread men? Typical Jillian. Hmm, not bad. How was your cookie? It was alright. Just alright? I used my usual recipe. It tasted fine, but why'd you make them like that? Make them like what? What did you do to their heads? What's wrong with their heads? You mean besides the fact that they're no longer connected to their bodies? What are you talking about? They all had heads when I last saw them. Well, what I last saw was a plate full of decapitated gingerbread men. That's weird. Seems like the kind of thing you'd do as a joke, you have to admit that. It does, but I just made regular gingerbread men, I swear. Will someone remove their heads? Ooh, I bet Miska did it. Or dog? I did put the plate on the coffee table. She could have easily reached them. But why would she just bite their heads off? Wouldn't she have eaten the whole thing? I don't know, dogs do random things sometimes. No dog would leave a plate of half-eaten cookies. I gotta see this. See, Miska did eat all the cookies. But that's not how it was before. They were all missing their heads. Well, that's how it is now. How do you explain what happened then? Look, Miska came in and tried a few cookies by biting off their heads, then heard you coming in and ran away. I didn't hear Miska running away. Anyway, once you left the room, she came back in and ate the rest of the cookies. I guess it could have happened that way. Of course that's how it happened. It's not like there's some kind of cookie bandit loose in our house. I guess there is, but her name is Miska. Right. Mystery solved. It's just so weird. You didn't eat those cookies, did you, Miska? Miska? Miska, we're not mad about the cookies. You don't have to hide. This one's not a cookie. Did you leave this under your cookie plate? No, let me see. What is it? Just looks like a Christmas decoration. Mom probably bought it. Dee, what's that for? I was gonna ask you. Maybe it stands for Dad. Mom might have gotten one for each of us. D also stands for Dog. Yeah, so what? I can't find Miska. She's probably hiding somewhere, ashamed from eating all those cookies. You know how she gets. Yeah, but she always comes running when you call her name. I'm starting to get worried. Miska? Miska, come on! Miska, where are you? See what I mean, Jillian? 
She might have a stomach ache. We better go look for her. Julian, look! It's just like the other one. Not exactly. E? What's that mean? I bet this is part of a set. It probably spells out like Merry Christmas or something. Merry Christmas doesn't need to use the letter D. Hmm. Maybe it spells out Adelaide. But why are they suddenly appearing in our house? Mom was just putting up the Christmas decorations. She probably dropped a few. Yeah, but this is getting weird. First the missing heads, then the missing dog, now these things. You're just getting jumpy. Let's go find where Miska's hiding. Julian, look! What's that one say? I. So we have a D, an E, and an I. Probably does spell out Adelaide. Let me see the other ones. What are you doing? See? D I E. Die. This isn't a decoration, it's a threat. We better find Miska. Who is that? Do you think it's dad playing a joke on us? Do you really think he'd do this? I guess not. It went towards the stairs. Come on. <laughs> Miska, are you down there? Miska, we're not mad at you for eating the cookies. Do you really still believe that? <laughs> Miska! She's probably too full to climb back up the stairs. Jillian, look. Merchy, merchy, merch, merch, merchy, merchy, merch, merchy, merchy, merch, merch, merchy, merchy, merch. Hey! If you like Jilly Natty videos, you're gonna love our merch. With a wide variety of products and designs, there's something for everyone. Just click on the links below and they'll take you to our Teespring store. Or just go to jillianandnatty.com. It's all good. So that was the Ginger Dead Man. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe. Be sure to check out our other two channels. There's Jillian and Natty Laugh, our comedy channel, and Jillian and Natty Life, our vlogging channel. They're a ton of fun. Tell us what you thought about this video on Instagram. We also post new pictures, videos, and stories most every day. We even post sneak previews of our upcoming videos, like this one. And remember, stay scared. Bye! So, do we ever find out, will your cat eat your eyeballs? Um, maybe. Maybe. It depends on the circumstances. Yeah, no, that's